Hi, I'd like to present the new update for Rapmaster 1.1. It comes with these two assets. The first of them is the chain. It has mostly the same options and there are these two sections uh, that have some new settings. And then there is the new Rapmaster Rope HD, which compared to the old uh, rope, which was based on the texture, now it is based on the geometry. And it also has these two sections that have some new settings. So let's first start with the chain. Let me quickly arrange it around the arm first. And as you will see here, all the functions work as they did for the other assets in Rapmaster. If you'd like to see a more in-depth video on them, on the noise settings, on the snapping to the surface, then please take a look at the Rapmaster walkthrough video, which you can find on my channel. Okay, we are mostly done here. Let's just add a little bit of noise. And as it said, let's add a little bit of offset to the snapping. So let's take a look at our settings now. They are mostly self-explanatory. Uh, the chain scale. Here's a uh, link spacing. So you can set the links to be further apart or closer to each other. Next up is rotation, uh, which is kind of a master rotation for the chain. Then there is the random rotation, for which you can also set the seed for the randomness. And uh, next up is the twist, for which to better illustrate, let me set the wrap master to the starting point. Okay, and you can see here that as I change the value of the twist, it happens along the length of the wrapping, which will give you a more random, more natural look. Something like this. And now, finally, let's take a look at Chainly Collection, which is collection that will be a source of the objects that will be instanced as a chain. So whatever you drop there will be instanced. For example, now we have just the round chain link, but we can add the other two and they will be repeated along the length. And for it, you have some extra options. So you can change the order in which they appear to be random with random instance pick, and then you can change the randomness seed. So that's how it looks. Let's, for example, leave just the thorn link. And that's pretty much it for the Rapmaster chain. So now let's move on to the Rapmaster Rope HD. It comes with these two kind of profiles that you can switch uh, here. And you can go into edit mode and also adjust their shape. And then the special setting for this asset is the twist. So we can uh, really adjust the shape of the rope. And then we have those settings for geometry. So subdiv and ldiv. And then also for this asset, there are special settings for the low poly, which basically is the old wrap master rope, but it may serve as the low poly base for the baking. And for it, we have the side settings. And then the LDIF is calculated in such a way that when you have the wrapping and you have some overlapping, and uh, then there will be more geometry at the places where the wrapping crosses itself, uh, something like this. And for this, you also have some control over, like here. And next, there is this adaptive reduce which will affect only the not overlapping part of the wrapping. And then finally, there is the thickness for the low poly, which works separately to the high poly version of the rope. And that concludes this video. I hope you like it. And as usual, you can find a link to all my assets in the description of this video. Thank you.